Hello and welcome everybody and in today's episode we have pleasure to present you Voodoo Limba Yeah, this is bike which one is um, a couple years old but when it was new it was a uh, very good price you can purchase this bike on Halfords for less than 300 quid uh, that was the New Year promotion and a friend of mine bought this bike and what we have here in my opinion this bike is extremely good value for the money uh, it's very difficult to find cyclocross or gravel grinder like this one um, in decent price you have to spend at least thousand quid to have uh, some kind of um, cyclocross bike but in this case, Voodoo square the circle and uh, we have Voodoo Limba uh, with excellent price. Of course you have some compromise um, because of the price, but all in all um, it's really really good proposition for somebody who's cycling and commuting all around the city. What do we have here? We have here aluminium frame. Uh, with, with very comfortable geometry uh, steel front fork, rigid one uh, we have here Shimano Claris group set basic um, FSA crank set and um, average quality wheels so this proposition is, is really really decent if you're searching for something um, which one is a long time for cycling running and you don't want to spend a fortune Voodoo is, uh, is just for you look at the bike, look at the details the head budget is just simply excellent in that price bracket difficult to find that sort of stuff on, on, on the bike yeah like I said this is Clive's group set uh, with uh, with uh, STI style brake levers and um, FSA crankset. We have here this brake, uh, and this is basic Tektro version uh, mechanical brake with uh, cable pulling. Which one is, in my opinion, excellent choice? Because if you put the hydraulic brakes the service and cost of running are going to be very very high and that one puts you off from this bike um, compared to me mechanical you just set them, uh, set them once and that's it and they are working for, for all time this is bike who is uh, belongs to a friend of mine from work and he asked me to do some service and upgrade a couple things uh, this bike have fitted um, security quick release like this one which one uh, are very nice uh, they prevent you stealing the wheels and missing <laughs> when you're parking somewhere and I upgrade those uh, top brake levers here and there they are very comfortable and very good when you're cycling all around the city because you can you can catch the brakes very quickly so it's just uh, like security and comfortable feature excellent choice so uh, yeah all in all in all we can say this bike from 1 to 10 in this price bracket of course we can give it to 9.5 so pretty good score of course the bike have some weak points but uh, they are not important the weak point was very flimsy and thin handlebar tame which one extreme, is extremely easy to exchange or upgrade for different one the cost is gonna be cheap and of course we have um, on this bike cheap tires like this one Kenda they are not the best ones and uh, if you're cycling a lot you you just catch the puncture on those wheels so solution is to replace those tire for something decent like Schwalbe or different tire which one have uh, 
really high puncture resistance but when you take everything from consideration this is one of the best option on the market this bike you can find in Halfords at the moment uh, with basic version like this one but in different uh, uh, paintwork slightly different blue and black and green and there is another version with hydraulic brisk disc brake which one I, I do not recommend it but particular, particularly this bike excellent joys and uh, yeah so I hope those video was helpful for you guys thank you very much and see you next time happy cycling